G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Joe Woodle and welcome back to 7 Days where I am in the middle of nowhere hiding in a tent in demolishers only. I'm trying to gamble, I'm trying to go big and try and find some better stuff so I've gone all the way north to the middle of bleeding nowhere trying to find the wasteland and I think I found it, I think this is a bit further north out in the next mountain range which means today I've kept the demos at bay by throwing pebbles around and I have all of my tools still, but it's time to get back on the bike and get out of here. I mean, that looks bloody cool, doesn't it? <laughs> Sometimes this game still makes me get distracted by the views and not pay attention to what I'm doing, but it was a pretty or reasonably uneventful night. A couple of demos here and there, but some well-placed peb throws got them away from me, so no real dramas. You haven't missed anything. I really just sat there and thought about my impending tomb all bloody night long. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong bloody way. I'm going south. I'm supposed to be going north. <laughs> 10 seconds, Josh. 10 seconds and you can't stuff something up. Get it together. I tell you what, I am absolutely banking and hedging all of my bets. I'm going to find some sort of gyrocopter or something to do with that all the way out here. That's not a, that's not a trader. That's just a random POI. That's fun because I'm so, so bloody far from home now. I'm five kilometers away from home. It's gonna take forever to get back there. Which actually makes me think actually, can the red bags from demos, do they, I think they have the chance to, oh, I think they have the chance to give me gyro stuff, like uh, a chassis. I'm not sure about the parts, but I think I've seen that before in my life. Look at you. And right on the dot too, right as 4 a.m. is about to tick on over. The sun is rising. Demos are dropping. A whole new world awaits us and there's nothing good. There's a few demos just like directly like a couple of inches inside the wasteland. So I am going to take advantage of that. And boop you. There's another one right there. There we go. First red bag in the wasteland. Please just give me a flat out gyro. A flat out gyro immediately. And I'll turn this thing around and go straight back home. Where the loot and gogs form. 307 loot level. What a jump. Back in, what, well, back in the Pine Forest, it was like 108. So it's tripled coming here. Quickly have a gander at you for nothing. For nothing. Scrap that, take the... <laughs> of course. Of course. Doesn't matter that I've tripled the loot level. Why would I think I'd ever find anything? It's funny now. Every demo I see is now an opportunity. Ooh. ooh opportunity rather than a liability oh, oh my god i love this rifle i'm like yeah i've clapped it out yeah i know that i'm so used to oh i'm so used to fighting demos that one tap of the zombie bear is absolutely gonna make me feel the fizz take all of that out of you what are you doing the t6 is obviously gonna be better by by only four, actually. Not that much better, but that's fine. In you all go. No extra mod spaces. At least I can sell you for a pretty bloody penny. <gasps> and you're made out of bones, too. And I need bones. I'm going to try and save as much of my um, AP. Did that... I thought that curse had disappeared when I was aiming down the scope. It's there now, but... Oh. But all right. Awful shooting. Awful shooting. You were so distracted by the bloody curse on your screen that you've got to actually hit your target. Dropped. Finished. Oh, not finished. Now finished. No red loot bags, though. You're being bloody greedy. Got some repair kits. Won't actually use those. No, I won't because it's going to take so long with all the rest of the things that I'm scrapping. Never mind. I'll use them in a bit. What's this joint? Are you a trader? Or, oh, good day, zombie dog. Or... No, you're something different. You're something different. You're like a compound. I mean, potentially, you might have what I need. Oh, you definitely do, though. More red bags. I tell you, this, the suppressed sniper rifle with the AP... They're in the wrong spots, that's why. With the AP rounds, absolutely godly. That looks like a pretty serious raid, actually. So it's a checkpoint. What level are you? What level are you going to be? You're... Oh, my goodness. Um, I just heard doors open. Was that like, was that a gunshot? I've never been like freaked out by like the atmospheric noise of this game before, but that one really sent me for a bit of a spin. 
Is there going to be demos in here? There surely is. And I kind of want to drop them at this higher level and see what loot bags they might give me. Definitely taking a, um... There you go. Definitely taking the more sightseeing tour. No? All right. Cop that. And cop that. Red loot bag inside. Almost woken up. I don't think they can get me up here, so I might be relatively safe for the moment. We're going to lead them back out the front regardless. Over we go. Over to here. Straight up the guts, please, everyone. In a nice orderly fashion. Got plenty of ammo. And the pigeons and vultures are ready for you. There's you. Oh, they, are they lined up? They were. Shit. They were for a moment, and then I binned it. Old mate. Uh, there. No, not quite. Still not quite. <laughs> That's a risky job there, Josh. If you tickle the guy in the back by accident, this whole place is going up. Couple of loot bags. Thank you. Super loot and gogs on for nothing much at all. Ooh, something much at all. A tier six chainsaw. <laughs> all right. Then absolutely not going to turn my nose up at that one. I wasn't really intending on raiding this place, but hey, if you're going to give me shit like that, I'd be silly not to. Don't need... No, I don't need the paper. You can go away. I'm chockers with stuff again, and my bike is also chockers. I just... I don't have room for all the loots. There's too much. I can hear um, a lot of not very nice... No not very nice noises, because there's a bloody wandering horde coming through. Well, actually, I mean, wandering hordes are, have actually the higher chance... Yeah, go on then. The higher chance of dropping the loot bag, so they might actually be an assets rather than a hindrance. So, so there you all are. I fired sat. I fired at least one round, so your attention should be on me. And if you all... Oh my goodness. If you all want to come this way... Oh my god. That's a couple of demos. Oh, but the rifle... The rifle's doing its work. Get a little distance. They're really bloody fast, so... Gone. You're gone, too. Shitting out loot bags. Good, good, good. I think it's just you remaining. That might have been almost all of them. I'm really starting to get a handle on this. I'm really starting to understand. Another tier 6 chainsaw? Fucking alright then, game. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, did I get... Oh, it was very close to it. He didn't infect me. I might have been to the mod again. Oh, I've got vitamins in, though. Fuck yeah, vitamins, look at that. You're protecting me. You know what? In that case then, double them all up. Put them all in. I'm super vitamin... Vi vi vitamin-y? Vitaminous? I'm full of vitamins. I was going to say, I did double check that I did do the mod right this time. I went and got punched in the face in a separate world to make sure it was working properly. And I was very surprised it didn't happen. The vitamins though. The beautiful vitamins saving me pills. I'm so, I'm so full. I'm so full of everything. This isn't what I came here for. But if I'm finding all this good shit, surely there's a gyro in there somewhere for me. There might be a few more around. I definitely haven't got to the end of this. This is such a big POI. I really shouldn't be here, but it's too late now. I'll take all of you. Oh, yep, there was one in there. I was about to say there's no one in the medical bay, but there absolutely was. There's always oh, a few. There's a few. It's probably a good job for the armor piercing through. Oh, through we go. I keep getting caught on that. Good. But I don't think I might. I was going to say, I don't think I'm going to get the chance for a double even right as I started lining up for me. Still use two rounds. Was there any more? Every couple of steps I take in here, there's another wave of demos. This is pretty, this is pretty intense. I feel like I'm absolutely about to cause a ruckus. There's a switch to open doors and this game really likes. Ooh. Uh oh, I right, get out of here then. This game really likes popping open doors and calling everybody in the world in. Yeah, look, I've opened that one. I'm not sure where all the demos are going to come through there are, though. You need to bloody re relax a little bit, please. You're just barking at shit and chewing on fences. Gone. Good. I'm not going to bother getting your bones right now because I'm definitely distracted by other things. Oh, I tried to jump over the barbed wire. Completely been to the jump. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they waiting for me? They're in there somewhere, I know. I kind of <laughs> really don't want to walk into here. If you close this gate behind me and trap me in here, I'm going to be so bloody upset with you, game. Okay, the door's still open. Oh my god, I saw it was locked and I spanned back around, but it was locked for a reason. No one... Oh my god, this feels awful. This feels like some Resident Evil shit. 
There's a button there. Not that I really want to go have a crack at it. Oh, this is going to be so bad. This is going to be so bloody bad. I figured. Oh, the penetrating rounds. Gone and gone. Okay. Just make sure no one heard the loud rounds. Maybe we should have brought a suppressor for you, but I don't have that book yet. Eat all of you. Take that. I'm finding 9mm ammo. More than I can find pocket space for. Holy shit. Oh, yeah, it's, it's, it's getting intense and it's staying intense. There's a couple. Didn't... Oh, I didn't even kill that guy. Wait for the shot and the guy at the back. You get out of the way, please. You need to die, please. I might even try to finish you off with the spin. Did that work? I think it did. I think it did. I'm just trying to be a little bit more stealthy. Apparently firing guns is pretty loud. Oh, there's a few. Oh, there's a few. That's all right. Let's get up on top of the roof and we'll deal with it afterwards. I don't know what these guys are going to do, actually. How are they going to get up to me? What are they going to break to get here? Oh, I know. Oh, no, I'm going to go this way. I'm going to go this way. You guys can all follow me. This goes back through here. They can either funnel through that or funnel through that little corridor that I just went through. Someone outside is mad as well, but either way, that should give me a bit of an angle on them to start with. It just depends on where they're going to come from. Might have to wait for them up here. I can see you. That's the dog god. They're beating their way through the bloody sand barrier walls. Okay. Oh, make the jump. Just made the jump. Wait from over here. Got eight rounds in the mag. Come on. You're not quite going the way I wanted you to, but all right. Right there. He didn't die. Why aren't they dying? They might, these, some of these guys must have more health than the other ones, but they're specially infected. You're gone. You're gone too. Quick little tactical reload. There was definitely more. Definitely, yeah, definitely more though. You're going to cop a regular round because you're just by yourself. Oh man, this is, this is way too intense. Oh, look at that though. T6 impact driver. I do not mind if I do at all. There may be some more demos coming my way, but I'm taking the time to quickly swap you over. T6 impact is always a good bloody day. Gorgeous. Thank you. You're loaded. You're loaded. Where did the others go? There's still some pelicans flapping about, but I'm going to take the long way back. Back out through here. There's the doggo that I shot. So this is where they would have come through. That wasn't the suppressed rifle, damn it. Oh my God, where am I? Where am I? And why is there fresh demos here? I think I'm coming to the wrong area. Or is it just, is it just like the next spot? I came through. Oh, he's gonna come through and say good day me. That's okay though. Oh, I came through here. Yeah, no, no, we're in the right spot. Oh, that was just having a nap. Oh, jeez. The pigeons have come to play. Oh, I'm going to get off this tech because it's way too weak to handle those guys. There's a couple of demos down there. Yeah, there you are. I was going to say, I don't really have much of a shot other than at your legs, so it's just going to have to do. You're gone. There's a red loop back down there from before, actually. I forgot about. I need... Oh, can you stop wiggling around, please? I'm trying to get an angle at you. That's another one down. I can't see your head. Is there anything but headshots just does nothing? Like, if I shoot him in the legs or the torso or anything like that, if I go for center mass, I, I barely even tickle him. You know what? Come over here. Come over here. Go like that. That was fucking dicey, but got it to work. You're gone. Okay, where was that loot bag? I thought I heard some footsteps. Now we're okay. Check you. Still none. Where's all your gyro stuff? I see some books and... Oh, none of the desks have anything in them, but that's okay. Still no needle and thread books. <laughs> I'm never going to find them, am I? I've said out loud that I want to find them too many times, and now I'm just never going to bloody find them. Make sure both my rifles are loaded. And we're on the other side of the checkpoints. Yeah, no, no, no. You're fine. Is it just... Oh, no, no, no. Don't, don't you dare. Don't you, don't you fucking dare explode that bloody, uh, bloody truck. That's what I'm looking for. You're gone. I did see, I was going to say, another one in the background over there. They tried to drop in behind me like they're hell divers. Don't ask what game I'm addicted to at the moment because it's, I'm not going to tell you. Though if you pay attention, you might be able to figure it out. Cheeky red loot bag. I did hear someone wake up in there. Eat you. Take the rest. Is it just, is it just you? Oh, there's two of them. 
That's all right. Yoom. You cop that. Don't panic. Panicking. <laughs> Not panicking lasted for about half a heartbeat, then immediately puckered again. It's just all pucker all the time. Oh, there's a drop. There's a drop coming in. Where are you going? Oh, you might. Nah, you're going to be back in the pine forest, aren't you? That also means that it's now midday. Oh, I just realized that, like, oh, of course. It's a checkpoint. I thought it was just a PY on the side of the road, but it's like, yeah, it's a checkpoint for another highway. That's kind of interesting. There's still more of this PY I need to go, though, like, through that area. Oh, <laughs> all right. Just breaking shit by accident. Don't mind me. Doors unlocked. All right, we're not done. We're not done. There's still more demos. There's still more loot bags. There's still more things to be... Oh, to be gotten. Regular rounds. Don't waste the APs. Oh, my. I was so close. I shot like the block that the button's on. Oh, that was... That was very nearly it. I've pissed off a few more. I'm just letting him come to me. You're by yourself. So you can go like that. I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure I can hear someone behind me. I'm staying focused on where I know there are demos, rather where I think there might be. You're gonna follow the same path. Yeah, you are. Oh, it's because of the door. Right, fair enough. See, when they're coming just like that, nice and slow. Oh, you suck of shit. When they're coming slowly paced like that, I have time to line them up. But when they all come in a big thick throng, things get a little bit more questionable. Check you. No. No, I can't believe I'm finding all these bloody urban combat books that aren't the one that I need. It's really starting to get frustrating. This looks like it's going to be the final battle before we get into, like, the main checkpoint area. Hup, and then hup. I thought so. There's a few of them. You can just get sat down immediately, though. Oh, oh they, they almost broke down the tent underneath me. I was getting way too cocky, way too complacent, and just feeling like I was okay. Turns out I... Almost definitely wasn't. Oh, shit. They, they didn't line up. They didn't line up exactly how I wanted them until when I panicked. Absolute panic. Gone. Doggo. Thank God for vitamins. And other doggo. Get back in there. Get back in there. Get back to where you might be. Ah, a little bit safer. I've got an abrasion, though. Turns out vitamins can't help against that. Up on top of the tent. Oh, lag spike. Oh, my God. Please don't explode, everyone. Please don't explode all the demos by tickling a goddamn truck. There's still a few more down there, but no one's beeping. Sat. That was one not in the head, but got the job done. Doggo gobbled the next one anyway. Shit. Better. Another one coming from another direction. Up. Oh, get up the fucking tent, please, dickhead. Ah, uh, where am I? I'm all the way back at the bloody start. That was a, a questionable choice to try and take that shot on. All right, bye. Nice. Stay there. Good. I think it's just the one left over. Oh, this was a move. This was... This was a bloody move, Josh. And none of them... None of them have given me a bloody loot bag yet. Oh. All right. Thank you. Oh, and an auger too. Fuck yeah. Oh, my God. The dream. The dr I mean, the achievable dream. The one that might actually have a chance of happening. Not all the other dreams that I try to have. A tier six sniper rifle. There's no uh, crates at the back of you. Let's have a squizzer gel. Let's have a cheeky Hansel and Gretel. You, come here. You're doing 126 compared to 121. Now, you're doing more because you're loaded with the other ammo. I'll change it over. Who's doing what? 118, 121, 126. I was quietly hoping I'd find a sniper rifle. I didn't want to jinx it by saying it out loud, though. So that's going to be my new regular ammo rifle. In you all go. Uh, get the last one out of you guys as well. Holy shit, yes. What a day. What a day to be a wordle. I haven't even got all, like, the main loot from this place yet either. That's going to open up you. Oh, can I, like, actually make this, like, a usable... Oh, hello. Like, a usable pathway? Yeah, here we go. If I get rid of this, this ute... I could just drive straight through the guts of it. Right up the guts of it, you bloody beauty. Vehicle book, thank you. Only a fucking shitload more till I get a gyrocopter. Thanks for nothing. But I have a nice little easy way out. Do you want to be the first victim of my tier 6 sniper? Don't care if you do or don't. Also, my reticle's gone now. Remember before when I had, like, the lines? Now it's gone, so... Not sure how, not sure why, but fuck yeah. I'm a happy boy. I'm all smiles. 
So there's a ladder going into this little bit. Is it like up and over then? And then down through you, lovely. I know I still have like the whole main loot area of this place still to go, but I can't turn down this. I'll forget it otherwise. Take all of you, shit on the wall, some ammo, a tier six steel sledgy boy. I mean, yeah, all right then. You can have that one. Keep my inventory nice and free. T6 steel gloves. Much better than what I'm currently wearing. Modify you. Flip you over. What a day. Coming to the wasteland. Apparently a really sodden good idea if you can actually stand up against the challenge. The durability of one of your armors is weak. Is that my... It must be my gloves, actually. The ones I just, just chucked on. Yeah, all right. Fair. I'll get them repaired in a moment. Oh, my God. I'll get them repaired in a moment. Dude, I'm clapped. I'm absolutely clapped like I'm lousy. I wanted to make double sure there wasn't any, like, bookshelves or anything here that I missed, but there's none. There's a gun safe in the corner. Explosive magazines, a couple of extra mods, some frockets, and some ammo. I'm, I've just dropped off a bunch of shit into boxes outside. I'm already chock-a-block again, and I haven't even got through the good shits. I'm going to pop open you. I'm going to pop open you. And pop open you. Any more tier 6 snipers? No, not quite. Some frock parts. You can keep all that. I have no use for any of them. You can keep all of that one too. Gun store box with... <laughs> I have so much 7.62. I have so much 7.62 ammo. If you weren't such a goddamn liability for clapping nipples, I'd be real bloody excited about you. A tier 6 spear. We get the upgrade on that one as well. Oh man, we got we got so much shit. Just want to see what's in the hardened chest. I'm gonna to have to do a lot of um sorting out of my inventory because I got so much shit. You can go, you can go, you can get red. I'll take what I can out of you. I've completely maxed out on lock picks, which is unusual. All right, I have to go and sort some shit out. I've got I've got too much stuff. I came here to find a trader, and instead got distracted by the first cool looking PY I went to. But given all the kick-ass shit that I've got, I reckon it was probably a good move. The tier 6 sniper alone makes that worthwhile. Plus all the armor I got as well. So I'm leaving a lot of this stuff behind. I've got a box. So many boxes of ammo. I'll actually take a couple of you. I'm actually going to mark this here. I'm going to go like this. Save waypoint. Uh, what looks like a chest to me. That does. I'm going to go two times boxes. So we know we can go back and grab that later on if I need. I still want to go and find a tradie in the wasteland somewhere. It's getting heckin' late. That raid took a bloody long time. I'm going to go get that derpo on the way through. There's got to be a trader out here somewhere. There's got to be a trader out here somewhere, and clear skies will help me find it. In fact, that road that keeps going further into the wasteland, surely gets out there somewhere. Surely. The drop's right here, right in the middle of the road. That's nice and convenient. Demo wants nothing to do with it. I'm wearing the appropriate dog, so... A baseball bat. Ooh, some red tea. Don't mind if I do. You. I'll just scrap you for the wood. It hurts me to do, but yeah, desperate times, desperate mission. I don't have the space for you anyway. I'm going to eat all those cornbreads right off the bat. Thank you. Open up those books. Come on, books. Explosives, tools, digest, and armored up. Fair enough then. Another drum mag. The M60's already got one in it. Uh, can I put that onto you? No, I can put the trigger mod onto... Onto the sniper. I can make the sniper full auto. I mean, we know that full auto in this game isn't always what you think full auto should be, but that's still pretty interesting. I think I saw a little town out to the right out here, but I do want to go back and go further. Oh, there's actually a highway up on the hill up there. If that links up, that would be lovely. I'm here for traders because traders can have gyrocopters and money will buy gyrocopters. That, I think, is going to be my best route to getting into the skies. Where do we think a trade is going to be? They're no longer, like, at the entryways into towns. I'm going to try and find them the old-fashioned way. Driving around in circles and hoping I stumble upon them. I think I see a little talky mouth on my map, which should mean that's where the trader is. Who? Oh, it looks like a... Oh, it's a trader gen. It's a trader gen. I can't see through the trees. Hold on. Oh, that's, that's more of a tree. I directly nailed the trunk and I... Oh! Completely rinsed my bike. I thought I'd... Oh, I went the wrong way. I thought I went the wrong way. I thought... Okay. I'm going to have to repair my bike. Hold on. Uh, Knackers, can you please get away from my girl? Thank you for that. What? What? What just happened? I didn't do that. You... 
Someone's got very excited down there and made an absolute fool of themselves. That's, um, that's gone real iffy. Oh, just when you thought today couldn't get any better. Just when you thought it couldn't get any better. Found good loot, found the wasteland, and I found Jen in a church at the altar waiting for me. How are you, Jen? We've got the best prices in the wasteland. All right. Yep, that's no, strictly business. I understand there's lots of people watching. We can't uh, get out to any shenanigans right about now. But what I do want to know from you, you've got vehicle adventure books. I'll take, ooh, I'll wait to buy them actually until I've got some benefits going. Steel, repair kits, a cook and grill. We all know what I want, Jen. And then after that, I want the gyro. No sign of a gyro. No sign of um, any uh, automatic drawbridges either. So I'm not going to waste my um, my sugar bites and stuff on nothing. So I'll just take... Mm, no, I don't need any of you. I'll take those ones. I'll take that one. And I'll take the medical journals as well. Because why not? Double check you. Nah, nothing. Mm, nah, nothing. Me take care of you. Anytime, Jen. Anytime. Any bloody time. It is always a privilege and a pleasure to be in your presence. I'll see you again before too long. Make sure my rifles are loaded. Uh, oh, and actually, while I'm here, may as well take your workstations. Not that I super duper near, but it's good practice. Job's done at Jen's. Oh, nah, you know, I'm just going oh, to leave. Go back this way. I wanted to go back to the north. So, oh, chuck on the handbrake. Swing her about. Pin the gap, and away we go. I've got time. If I can find a demo, uh, not a demo. <laughs> if I can find, because finding a demo is very bloody easy. If I can find a um a town in the wasteland, we're going to find the tradie just before they close up shop. Excuse me, mind the pole. It's a gamble because I have nowhere to stay at the moment. But if I risk it for the biscuit and find a Tim Tam, then it's a good result. So there's the highway. Oh, and there's the intersection. So it does link up. Bloody beautiful. I'm just going to take a quick little shortcut because I don't have the time. So, tradie closes at, uh, what is it? Oh, like 2050. So, I've got about an hour. Got about an hour to try and find some sort of trader out there. They don't restock until day 40 anyway. So, if they do have the gyro, well, I can still buy it in the morning if I don't have time to do it right now. But I'm backing myself. Uh, the all of today has me has been me making bad decisions, but backing myself in, and it's paid off. At some point, my luck will run out, but I'll try to pretend like that's not a reality. Holy shit. Holy shit, no way. He's right there. He's right there. He's got the open signs. That's a Trader Joel. Fucking perfect. Absolutely bonzum. Open the doors, please. Because there are demos out here, and I'd like to park my bike inside. In we go. Close the door behind us. No bloody way. No bloody way if I stumbled across Joel. I'm going to back that I re I'm gonna hope rather that it's actually gonna be what you what I need from you I'm so excited I can't even bloody talk anymore give me all of that you can hold on to those ones that one that one uh hold on to you you and you that come with me that'll come with me and that come with me all right all right jolly boy now's the moment now is the bloody moment you beefcake you talk to you customize fitting he's got some mods actually that I wouldn't mind having just oh, quick quick just quick everything. Just check here. Gyro. No, damn it. Drawbridge. No, damn it. There's no sugar butts in you. There's always some stuff in you that I don't really need. Ooh, any of those. I'll take a couple of coffees. I feel like I've earned it. You may not have exactly what I was looking for, but I'm still going to do some business with you. I will actually chuck in the sugar butts for this. I'll also chuck in an awesome sauce because I have a couple. There's a few things I want to sell you. Uh, and we'll go pumpkin cheesecake as well. I'll save the last one in case I do find that gyro, but for now, I'm gonna go like this. See your inventory. I'm gonna sell you that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one. Also the cash, the gold nugs, and I think that will just about do us. That frees up a lot of bloody space, though. That's bloody beautiful. Right. You come with me. You come with me. I will... Oh, I just sold those... Oh, you can get sold too, actually. So, <laughs> I just sold the helmets that I could have put the mods into, but that's all fine. Um, what else you got? I'll take the books. You, that one. Tech planets. Ah, <sighs> just, I'm getting so many things that aren't what I actually need. So many different things. Ah, that's everything. Thank you for that. I'm going to go you, you, all of that one, and you. I can now make a stun button. Great, love that for no one. Quickly check downstairs for some cheeky bookshelves. Knife guy. Ooh, a lot of books in you. Thank you. Cheeky snacks as well. Thank you very much. Um, 
no other books around at all. I'm really, really, really pining for that bloody needle and thread book, but it just doesn't seem like it's going to come my way anytime soon. Grab the keys. Thank you very much. It's real late in the day. I might have to just find somewhere to bunker down. Somewhere small I can get into nice and quickly. Because I'm kind of out of time. Oh, I just realized that was the last book I needed for the, um, uh, for Forge Ahead as well. I can make my own Crucible. Which, I mean, cool. That would have helped me at some point, but not really right now. But still good to know. We're ticking off boxes. Yet another book series the game's giving me that aren't what I actually need. Well, where are we going to go? We've got half an hour. I'm kind of in the middle of nowhere. There's, oh, I could probably get back... Ow. I'm going to get back to the pine forest just to make life a little bit safer um, overnight. I don't really want to run too many risks, if not absolutely necessary. I'm going to go back to the other highway because it's faster. Um, yeah, oh, that's a fence. Yeah, I think that's the right move. I think it's the right move to go to the pine forest. The wasteland, heck and dicey, heck and rewarding. But if I'm not raiding, I may as well be somewhere I can take my slippers off. Nighttime has just fallen, just as I made it out of the wasteland and back into the fuzzy stuff. Um, I mean, do I even really... Oh, there's a deer over there. A doe, a deer, a female deer. Do I even really need to find a POI to shack up into? Or can I just... I, could, I mean, look, there's, like, there's no one here. I could just I could just spend the night under the stars. It's been a little while. Or so, I don't think I've ever really done that, actually. But, like, he's going and trying raiding somewhere a bit more of a risk than is absolutely necessary. Like, I can one-tap demos with the suppressed rifle... And really not have too much to worry about. I could just stay here all night. I could have stayed there, but just so I have a better line of sight, I'm going to go down to this intersection down here. Nice smooth tarmac all over the place so I can see where the demos are coming from from a mile away. And we're fine. There's a chook. G'day, chook. Just crossing the road. We have to tell where the punchline one of these... Oh. Oh, right. Yeah, no, there is actually a downside to not being in shelter. Occasionally it rains. Well, you know what then? I know that joint down there is nice and clear. I've already cleared it out, so I don't have too much to worry about. It's in the wasteland, so if I do... Uh, if I do pop a couple of demos with my stealthy sniper rifle, I might get a loot bag and I might find some good gubs, but that's the closest POI, even though it's in the wasteland, that has no one in it. So that's where I'm going. That could be my shelter for the night. Oh, that was some sweet air. Like a Napoleon freaking dynamite getting three feet of air that time. We're good. The speedy bike is wonderful. Just gonna park up my bike. I mean, it's not much, but it's something just in here. I'm gonna turn off that headlight, actually, and get further into the POI. But I, I don't really know where I want to stay now, actually. Like, anywhere with a roof over my head, I guess. So, in here, there's no, like... Ooh, ammo pile. There's no, like, actually solid buildings in here at all, so there's no, like, good options. I'll just stay here in the dark and more or less the middle of the POI, so no one walking around the outside should know that I'm here. I think that's the right move. Well, I think that's going to do us then. I reckon I'm going to spend one more day in the wasteland. Now that I know that there's a town... Oh, yeah, that'll me. There's a town up here next to Trady Joel. I'm going to try and push through that. Those red loot bags here, they're giving me shitloads of ammo, but I reckon there's a chance it can give me the gyro parts. If I find anything gyro, I'll be stoked, but one more day in the wasteland, I think, then... I'm just going to have to grit it between my teeth and maybe even ride... Oh, okay. Go down this way. Those two roads there should link up so I can take that way home. Go see that tradie. Go see that tradie. And then get back here again. Because Horde Knight isn't far away. Not very far away at all, actually. So if I get back home, it's time to rebuild my Horde base and get prepared. We'll I'll have to delay getting re getting prepared in the next episode because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the patrons of Patreon who made this episode possible. If you liked, make sure you hit the like button down below and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. If I don't talk to you there first, I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.